Hello everyone, Green Gemini here with a fun, new, exciting game called Startup Company. Uh, Startup Company is an early access game on Steam. Um, honestly, I don't remember how much it was. I think it was like ten bucks. Uh, there's, you know, there's still a lot of room for improvement with this. Uh, I've, I've played it for a couple of hours, but I figured I'd go ahead and uh, start an episode on it. Basically, what the game is is it is a game where you start your own uh, technology company. Um, you create products and you get contracts and fulfill those contracts to make money. Uh, and then you create your own platform, whether it be a social media platform, um, a video platform, you know, like YouTube type deal. Um, so I think this might be uh, pretty interesting to see uh, what happens with this. Um, like I said, it's early access. Um, and uh, yeah, so I, I think we'll just go ahead and jump in here. Uh, so we'll go ahead and do a new game. Um, let's see. To get started, enter a name for your company below. So, um, let's see. Why don't we go ahead and name it uh, Gemini... Um, I don't know, Gemini... Huh, well, <laughs> this, is, this is a lot harder than what I thought. Um, Gemini... Uh... Let's just say Gemini Inc. I know it's kind of boring, kind of simple, but whatever. Um, all right, so maximum amount, let's see, finance, loans, uh, received a new email. Let's read the email first. From Jonas, day one. Hi there. Welcome to Startup Company Beta. As the game is under constant development, the amount of tips, hints, are, are the amount of tips and hints are greatly reduced. Uh, this means you have a lot to learn for yourself. Uh, to get started, here's a few hints. So, first thing, go to finance, take out a loan. Hire a sales executive to get contracts. And to complete your first contract, you will need to hire a developer and develop the required components. Alright, sounds simple enough. I uh, hope you have fun. Feel free to reach out as always. Best, Jonas. Alright, well... I mean, first thing is first, yes, we are going to get a loan. Um, not going to get a sales executive first yet, though, uh, only because the sales executive makes phone calls to get contracts, but we can't do contracts if we don't have employees to do anything, right? Um, okay, so this is our little office building, you know, one little office building. Um, let's go ahead and click on loans at Easy Money. First one, $40,000, go ahead and take that. Okay. And we received another email. Congratulations with your new loan. Hello, Gemini Inc. Requested loan of $40,000 has been transferred to your bank account. Payments will happen automatically starting from tomorrow. You know, that was pretty... Um, we might want to take a look at that. So, $40,000, 365 days to pay it, 30% interest. Wow. Uh, $128 a day and 20 cents. All right, so total amount that's going to be paid back is $46,793. Ew. Yikes. Well, maybe we can get that paid back sooner. Maybe. All right, let's see what we need to do here. Um, first, we need some employees. Uh, well, I mean, we can put desks in here, but we're not going to be able to put any desks in there if we don't have any employees to do uh, that, you know, we have to fill them. Uh, so, sales executive we don't want to do first. First, we want to go ahead and do a developer. The developer is basically the entry level uh, person who does the little technical components that we need to start building our products. Um, we're going to go ahead and go, let's go three days. Do we want to do three days or just one day? Now, let's just do one day. Let's see how many uh, applicants we get in in one day. So let's go ahead and uh, start the game off here. Uh, now, I have learned a couple of little shortcuts. Uh, your number keys, one, two, three, are your speed. So one will pause, uh, two will be your play, and then three will be your fast forward. Now, even though we're on regular play, you can see how the time goes a little fast. Now, this is awesome right here. We're getting a lot of people applying. Uh, if we look at those who have applied, You've got 24 hours from the time that they've applied to either accept it or just, you know, let it go. Um, now, when we're looking at these people, 
let's see, one percent is the amount of were requires by this employee to be hired. Uh, the uh, money obviously is you know how much it costs. Uh, developer 96% meaning that is their speed so not really sure that we want to go with a 96% person uh, probably want to go with someone a little bit higher uh, let's keep the game going here so we've got 119 128% 138% I think we'll give it a little bit of time to see um, how many more people apply here 139% that's good that's good uh, let's see We'll give that a little bit more time. As we are getting our candidates in here, we will go ahead and look at our desks. So in our little area here, we can only have eight desks. Uh, now, how I know that is if we click on, let's see, finance. Nope, that's not where it's at. Inventory, that's not where it's at. All right, hang on, okay, building. Here under company profile. So we have a small building. Uh, maximum workstations, uh, $8, or eight, $8, oh my god. Uh, maximum workstations is eight. Uh, payment up front, $10,000. Rent is $3,000 a month. Yeah, I don't like that. Okay. All right, we have nine candidates in here. Okay, we'll look at that in just a minute. All right, so I at least want two... I'm gonna say two developers right now. Uh oh, my game is, I don't know what's going on with it. Okay, so two for now. Um, let's see, 139%, 138%. I mean, those seem to be pretty good. You know what, we'll go ahead and do, uh, we'll hire that one. And we'll hire Isaiah. All right, so we'll go ahead and put uh, Sally here. Um, now, Sally has the option to develop certain things. So a UI component, a backend component, network component, database component, uh, and encryption component. Ugh, tongue twister. Uh, so, and you can see how long it's gonna take for them to do this. So 5.6 hours, 2.8 hours, 4.2, 2.8, and 1.4. Now, obviously in parentheses, two hours, that's about how long it usually takes, but with her speed that she's at 142%, it'll actually only take her 1.4 hours to do it. So if we click on that, we have to research the component first and confirm it, and then you have to go ahead and select it for her to do. Uh, then we're gonna go ahead and put Isaiah here, and we'll go ahead and have Isaiah do some back-end components. Now, as you can see, for Isaiah, this did not stay unlocked. So each of these needs to be unlocked for each person. Uh, so you kind of have to watch about what you're spending um, because you can't, I mean, if you wanted this unlocked again, yeah, it's gonna cost you $1,000, but you also want backend components too, along with everything else. So you kind of have to play around with that a little bit to see, you know, do I want to unlock both of these at once or do I just want one of them? Now, the other thing you have to watch with your employees is that you have to watch there. You have to send them on vacation every once in a while, uh, remove them from that desk, and so on and so forth. Now, their schedule, you can actually adjust their scheduled hours, uh, but you need an HR manager to do that, so that's gonna be later on down the road. And then this will give you your stats. So this person, let's see, required were uh, 1%, uh, employment zero days, less vacation never, salary, beginner, which we can upgrade later on. Uh, once we get to tier five, we have our base speed, office bonus, manager bonus eventually, and then mood penalty, so far nothing. Um, so basically this will make their mood go down throughout the day. Uh, now, we actually can't do anything right now because the day is over with. These two are off of work, so we can go ahead and jump start to the next day because we don't really have anything else that we need to do. Now, the employees, uh, candidates are still in here if we wanted to hire some more. As you can see, there's an hour left for these couple guys, uh, two hours left and four hours left and so on and so forth. Um, but I don't really think we need anything else right now when it comes to them. Uh, now, for... <laughs> these guys the thing about this game is that so once that person's done you have to click on it again in order to get it going again um, 
So it's a lot of clicking in the very beginning of this. And that's just because we don't have a manager yet. Once we get a manager, we will be able to basically assign the manager to these guys and they will just continue working on what we select for them, which is good. You know, that way we don't have to sit here and micromanage every single time that she completes something and tell her to do something else. So we're going through and we're making those components. Now we're going to go ahead and I'd say let's go ahead and hire a sales executive because that's the only way we're going to make money is by um, getting contracts. And the only way to get contracts is to have someone call and get those contracts. So we'll go ahead and put the sales executive in over, hang on, let me zoom out some here. Okay. Put the sales executive over there. And who's applied already? We have two candidates. Uh, that's for a developer. So 141% there. Let's jump start to the next day. Now, when you put in a request to hire someone and um, it's at the end of the day, when you hit go to next day, it'll actually put more candidates in for you that have applied overnight. Now, for right now, we only have, we've only got two people. So 150% there and 141% for Laura. I think we're gonna go ahead and do Stanley. Stanley's at a little bit more of an advantage um, and he's a little bit cheaper. So we'll go ahead and hire him. So we will put Stanley over here at this desk uh, let's see, contract type, we can't uh, change any of that stuff yet, can't do anything with that. So we'll go ahead and just search for a contract. So searching, searching, while he's searching, I need to come back here to these guys. I always forget this in the beginning. I always forget that I have to click back on them again. Do, do, do. Okay, he's done with that. So we'll respond to the contract. Uh, now, high urgency, depending on the urgency of the contract, a higher urgency contract will pay more money than what a lower urgency contract will. Now, obviously, right now, we're not going to get paid a whole lot just because, you know, we're brand new. We're a brand new startup company, right? Uh, so this we can actually fulfill right away, uh, and it'll give us uh, about $2,000 almost. So we'll accept the contract, and then we're going to go ahead and click on deliver now because we can deliver this contract already. See, this is why you start doing this stuff first before you do the sales guy. That way you have products to do. Now, already up to tier two, good. Designer, designer produces uh, graphical, graphical components. So we can go ahead and get a designer in here uh, and then new items unlocked. Ooh, yay, water cooler. So we'll go ahead and search for another contract and we'll play the game again. See, and this is the thing about this game. If you don't pause it during certain times when you're doing this, then it won't pause itself and it'll just keep going. And then these people will just sit here with nothing to do, which is unfortunate because, I mean, in the beginning, it's, you know, it's not too bad. Um, we'll accept that one, another 2,000. Let's see, click back on him. You know, I mean, it's not too bad, I guess, but, you know, we kind of want to... Kind of want to just keep going. Uh, now, the other thing that you want to be sure of is that if you grab a contract at the end of the day, and I'll show you this here in just a minute, um, once we get uh, our new contract in here, you have a certain amount of time that you have to do the contract in. Now, in order to, you know, without any penalty or anything like that, you know, if you're late on a contract, then you're going to be, um, Oh, you're going to be deducted money because of it. So with this one, it's a higher urgency. We'll get almost $4,000. We have 24 hours to do this contract. We need, let's see, it says we have two components and we need three. So the need and what we have is there. Uh, now that is a back end component. So the gentleman over there, what is his name? I don't remember. Uh, Isaiah. Isaiah is working on the backend component and you can see we have 22 hours left. Now if we were to say have to jump to the next day, all of that time in the overnight hours, that would go down. So if we, if, if it were eight hours overnight, then that would go down to, you know, 21 minus eight, uh, to probably one, 13 hours left. Can't do math right now in my head for some reason. Not sure why, but you know, whatever. It's been a busy day. 
Um, okay, so we've got those three, so we'll go ahead and deliver now. That'll be $4,000 and search for another contract. So this is kind of, you know, kind of the beginning part of it. Um, it's, you know, it's it's kind of the same thing, kind of monotonous day in, day out. Um, yeah, it kind of reminds me of my job a little bit just because it's, I mean, it's data entry, but I'm a supervisor. Uh, so, I mean, but it's all right. You know, I mean, it's, it's a good job. I really like what I do. Um, and this just kind of reminds me of it. Um, it's also, I mean, it's a technology company, but we lend out money, so it is what it is. Anyway, uh, we'll go ahead and accept this contract. We have 26 hours, um, and our backend component, we only need two of them. Uh, now, even though it is two o'clock in the afternoon, he's getting ready to have one done, uh, and then we'll go ahead and assign him here another one, hopefully shortly. Nope, he left at three o'clock. That stinks. That really stinks. So we have 25 hours left. Let me go ahead and can I fast forward this any faster? All right, so we have 24 hours left. We jump to the next day. There you go, boom, nine hours left, not good. Not good. Uh, he's already got one of those backend components done. Now it's gonna take 3.2 hours to get one of those made, which isn't going to be too bad. I think what I'm gonna do with her for the UI component, I think I'm gonna have her actually do, um, start doing the back end components. Just because I wanna be able to get more in here. Um, so let me pause that. So he's done with that. I'm gonna go ahead and spend a thousand dollars to unlock that and have her work on those as well. So for her, it's gonna take 3.3 hours cause she's 121%. He is going to take 3.3 hours cause he's 120%. So they're about the same. And we'll go ahead and deliver that contract. All right, up to tier three already. So now I can get a manager, a small retirement plan, and new items unlocked. Very nice. All right, so he needs to get us another contract. Um, now that I have a manager available to me, I think what I wanna do is I wanna go ahead and do I wanna hire more developers or do I want a manager? I think I want a manager. Yeah, I want a manager. So let's go in here to manager. Uh, one day, beginner manager, start recruiting. All right, so we'll go ahead and do that. Uh, we will purchase another desk. And we'll put that desk, come on, put that desk over here. Um, I want to move this desk. How do I move? Okay, there we go. That desk gets moved over there. Uh, respond to contract, low urgency, oh, 1600. Well, I mean, I need all the money I can get right now. So we'll do that. Um, ooh, it's gonna take five of those. Okay. All right, that's fine. Uh, search for another contract. You, you people and your idling. So I'll have you do that since we just used a bunch of those. And I need one more desk because what I'm gonna do is I'm also going to hire a, um, oh, I'm gonna hire another uh, developer. So jump start to the next day. I've had two candidates apply for the manager position, 118% and 88%. So Earl, you are hired. So Earl can go over here. Now with Earl, I can assign up to three people for him to be in charge of. So I'm actually just going to give him the developers and the reason for that is because I can handle this guy by myself. Um, and I'm also going to have another developer coming in here shortly. Uh, now, again, this is where I falter. Let's pause the game. Um, you do that. And then you do, you're already on that. Okay, good. And the good thing about the manager too, you can see how their uh, percentage went up. So 177%. And, <clears throat> pardon me, 176%. So the manager gives a bonus per employee is 61%, yay. All right, now recruitment, uh, we need another developer. So we'll go ahead and start recruiting on that. And play the game, respond to contract. Okay, we'll go ahead and accept that and deliver it. And search for another contract. See how repetitious this is getting right now? <laughs> One thing right after the other. But, you know, it's it's really not that bad. It's pretty easy. Um, 
Let's see, waiting instructions, and I don't have enough yet. High urgency. Ooh, six thousand dollars. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do that because we're gonna get. Oh, well, still it's twenty-four hours. No big deal. All right, we need another developer. Um, one hundred eleven, hundred thirty-four. Lillian, you're hired. We will go ahead and hire Lillian. Uh, select and I actually want you to do some back-end components because we are running out very quickly uh, let's see and you're at 141 percent okay that'll that'll be fine jump start to the next day huh okay okay we're going we're moving click 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 going 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 one more boom six thousand dollars in our pocket so we're up to $28,000. Now we can have eight desks in here. So one, two, three, four, five. We have five in here right now. Uh, in order to get to the next building, we need $35,000 up front. Rent is $6,000 a month, uh, which yeah, it's gonna be a little expensive. Oh, small retirement plan, forgot to do that. So 750 per month on that. Ugh. Well, that's okay. Um, where is, okay, finance. So the um, next, okay, last 30 days. So far, we've made $18,980. Uh, bank balance is 28,000 per day, negative. Yeah, we're losing money right now, but that's okay. The only reason why we're losing money is because we, you know, we have to lose money. We're gonna, lo gonna spend money to make money. Hopefully we'll be able to uh, make more money very quickly. Um, he needs to manage that person. Okay, so we have two people doing backend components, one person doing a UI component. Um, ooh, ooh, interesting, interesting. Okay, we'll go ahead and accept that contract. Um, that's gonna be a decent amount of money. When she's done with this, we will go ahead and have her do an encryption key and confirm on that. So she will work on that. That's gonna take her a little while. She's not gonna get done with it today. She'll finish it tomorrow morning. But we have 22 hours to get that encryption component. So we'll be fine. We'll be able to get that. Uh, you know, I think the next thing we're gonna do is we might, um, let's see, a candidates. Mm, hang on, let me pause that. We might wanna go ahead and hire another developer. I can have, I have five desks, I can have eight. So how much do these cost? $3,000 a piece, Oy. Um, If I do one there, forgot. Okay, so if you, when you're placing this stuff down, you hold shift and then left click, it'll keep what you have there. So granted I only needed two more. Um, it's not, I don't want that, no. Nope. I don't, I don't know what to do. Oh, well, okay. So I bought it anyway. Um, all right, right click to move and we'll just put you over there. So I definitely need a designer um, and I'm gonna go ahead and hire this other developer at 149%. I'm gonna need him. I really am. Now, how about, okay, we'll put him there and then, oh, what do I want you to work on? How about you work on network components? Okay, so you can work on that. Um, so that $6,600 is gonna help us out a lot. Let's see, recruitment, I really need a designer. 1,700, we'll do it. And then overnight hours, hopefully that will help us out. Uh, let's see, is that Michelle or Michael? <laughs> Michael, looks like Michael, I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that's really interesting um, because I actually work with a gentleman with that name. No, I don't. Yeah, I do. Well, not personally, but it's just, I don't know, that's weird. That's really weird. Okay, anyway. Um, 
Okay, so do 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 waiting 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 come on. I just we're almost done with that. I know we are I know oh there it is There it is got it Got it 6600 okay search for contract him. I'm gonna have to micromanage which is unfortunate, but that's okay Um. Okay We only have one designer that has applied really only one and he's at 88%. I don't like that. I don't I don't like that at all. Um, ooh, what is this? Wireframe component. Isn't that for uh, yeah, that's for the designer. 29 hours, $3,800. Uh yeah, okay, fine. And okay, we'll go ahead and hire him. Probably gonna be may, might be a bad decision. It might be, but uh, I'm hoping it's not. I'm going to cross my fingers and hope it's not. Uh, you're still working on okay. You're working on encryption component. Good. Uh, backend components. We have nine. I'm gonna need you to start working on that. Oh, of course, Martha Wilkins. Somebody else applied. Ooh, 142%. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna hire you. Sorry, buddy. Um, jump to the start of the next day. And I'm gonna wait for him to finish that first and then I'm gonna fire him. Um, and that's, mm, that's just, you know, that's just the way it is. Uh, dismiss, fire, confirm, sorry. And select you to go there and you need to do that. I mean, he was good for what I had him for, but he just, he wasn't going to cut it. Uh, all right, tier four. Yay. Uh, lead developer we can hire. Uh, new items we can unlock, we have unlocked as well. Ooh, very nice, very nice. Office bonus, office bonus. I like office bonuses. All right, so you know what? Here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking we're good there. I'm thinking we're good to go ahead and just leave it here for now. Um, and, uh, yeah. Yeah, this is, this is great. This is a lot of fun. Um, I actually thought this was going to be, when I was playing this myself, uh, I thought that it was going to be, you know, kind of hard to, to do something like this, you know, for this game. But uh, it's really not. It's really not that bad. So, anyway, please let me know what you think. Uh, let me know, well, just let me know what you think of the game. I, I mean, I like it so far. Uh, this is going to be really interesting to see how this plays out. Next episode, we'll probably go into a little bit of this uh, create product part of it. Um, and then we definitely have, we have two more open desks, so we might be able to hire some more people. I definitely want to try and get up to a decent amount of money in the bank to where uh, we can look at maybe getting a bigger building in the next episode, but it that may not happen. I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see. So that is all that I have. Um, down in the description below is where you can look for me on Facebook, Twitter, uh, oh, what else is there? Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Um, and then also there's that subscribe button down below as well. Please click on that. Subscribe to my channel. Uh, if you are interested at all, there is a donation link down there as well. Um, feel free to take a look at it. So thank you everyone for joining me today. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.